So back to high intensity, 90 seconds. I want you to get in that power stance. Everybody check your posture, because I think as we start to get tired, we kind of start to do this a little bit, right? So big posture, big weights up, cross your body jabs. Here we go, 30 seconds, out and in, out and in. Good, good, you got it. So straighten your elbow and bring it right back in. Quick recoil, good, try to make it quick. Out and in, out and in, out and in, good. Use your torso, so keep your tummy muscles in nice and tight, you got it. Let's go, five seconds, four, three, two, one. Set your weights down, take your feet wide, jump squats, 10 of them, here we go. 10, sit it back, nine, eight, big arm swing, seven, you got it, six, five, four, three, you can do it, two, one, grab your weights, tummy's tight, power stance, go, jab, 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 you have 20 seconds, come on, out and in, out and in, Tommy is tight. Let's go. 10 seconds. Woo, you can do it. Eight. You can do it. Keep going. Out and in. Out and in. Three, two, one. Good. Walk it out. Hold your weights if you'd like. Walk it out. Keep your tummy tight. Check your posture. Okay? Little bit of big walking. Okay? We did that wide base walking for warm up. That would be something good to do right now, okay? A little active recovery, kind of bending into your hips and knees a little bit. Nice and easy. The reason for doing this, we're bringing our heart rates down a little bit because we're gonna go to the floor, okay? So, I want you guys to keep walking around, but I want you to look up here so you can see what we're doing, okay? You're gonna be on the floor on your back, okay? Don't do it yet, keep walking it out. You're gonna be on your back, okay? You're gonna hold your weight up. You're gonna press it up and come up to your opposite forearm, and then you're gonna lower down. So you're gonna push it up and come down. Press up and come down. So basically you're moving at sort of a diagonal motion, okay, to get to that forearm. Okay, so here's my forearm, I'm down on the floor. I'm gonna push it up and come up to my forearm and then I'm gonna go down. Up, and a, an additional challenge is to keep your elbows straight the whole time, okay? If you're not going to, your, to the floor, yeah, um, so if you're not going to the floor, here's what I would say to do. Sit down, lean back, and then I want you to just reach over, okay? So this is for obliques and, and tummy, okay? So if you're not on the floor, I want you to lean back on your chair, okay? Right hand is gonna go first, okay? You're on your back, right hand first. You know what you're doing? You're cut, listen, listen up. You're pushing up onto your forearm. You're gonna do 45 seconds on your right side. Right side only. Okay, put the weight in your right hand. Lay on your back. Okay, hold that weight up towards the ceiling. Your elbow's straight, ready? You're gonna punch it up and bring yourself onto your left forearm. Think about it like this. We're trying to get up from the floor. So you wanna to come to your forearm like this, and then lower down. Do it again, same side. Lower down. Up to your forearm, lower down. Punch the ceiling. I wanna see you propped up on your forearm. Yes, good. Keep going, five seconds. On your forearm. On your forearm and then come down. Switch. Your weight is in your left hand, okay? You're gonna punch it up and come up so you're, you're on your right forearm. You're resting on your right forearm. Lower down, punch up. Yeah, punch up onto that right forearm. Punch up and across. Punch. You're using those obliques. You're using those core muscles. Punch it up. Lift your body up off the floor. Punch onto that forearm. Punch. Good. Three more. Crank out three more. Up to that forearm. 
out your arms and your legs. So full body stretch. So you're really lengthening your stomach. If you're sitting, just raise your arms up over your head. Or you can come to standing and do it too. That's fine. Stretching out those stomach muscles. Okay? Good. When you're there, I want you to take a couple of nice deep breaths in and out. In and out. In and out. And then I want you to come to your side. And then however you can do it safely, you're going to make your way back up to standing. Chair if you need to. Take your time though, okay? Grab some water. Yep, or if you're just on the floor like now till the end, I mean, that's okay too. It's all good. All right, once you're up, grab water. Walk it out. You guys were super close, okay? Walk it out. That was probably tough. You probably feel like you want to take a nap now, right? Not happening. Okay, we can do it. We're almost done. Yay. Walk it out. Do a little, let's shake out the chest a little bit. Shake out those arms. Yep. Check your posture. Good. Good. Take your feet nice and wide. I want you to bring your hands to your thighs like this. Hands to your thighs. I want you to stand up nice and tall. Open up your chest. Pull your shoulder blades together. Nice and tall. Press your hips forward. Press your chest forward. Get your posture big. Good. Do it again. Down. Push through your legs. Come all the way up. Pull those shoulder blades together. Everybody needs a posture check. Yes. Open those hands. One more time. Down. Push away from your legs. Come all the way up. Nice and big. All right. Shake out those arms. Get your chair. You have one last high intensity interval. It's that chair burpee, okay? So this is the one where you're gonna reach. So one, one correction from earlier. I want you guys to try to get up as straight as you can when you come right here because everybody's like this, okay? So when you come up to standing, I want everything to be straight and I want you to imagine there being a wall behind you. That's how straight I want your body, okay? So you're gonna reach or jump up, hands to the chair, out, out, in, in, reach or jump up, get straight, okay? Straight. Ready? Three, two, one, here we go. This is last high intensity interval, make it count. Out, out, in, in, big ups, okay? We might throw a push up in there if we're, if we're feeling good, okay? Big reach, out, out, in, in, big ups. Imagine that wall behind you. Out, out, in, in, quick feet, big posture. Out, out, in, in, let's go, get up. Out, out, in, in, push up. Out, out, push up, in, in, up. Good, do it again. Up, push up, in, up, good, you got it, up, make it big, out, out, in, in, move those legs, you can do it, out, out, in, in, up, out, out, in, in, up, get tall, Woo! you can do it. Push up on the next one. Out, out, push up. In, in, up. Let's go. You're strong. You're so strong. Keep going. You can do it. Let's go. Big ups. One more good one. Make it big. Good. Woo! Walk or jog it out. Walk or jog it out. Nice. Work. All right, nice and easy. Walk or jog it out. Side steps, okay? Side steps. Side steps, okay? Each direction, right and left. Cover some space. Woo! Next up, here's what I want you to think about. Floor transfers, okay? So you're gonna get all the way down and all the way up 
and that's one repetition, okay? So what is all the way down? What is all the way up? I think if you're up for it, so if you're all the way up, you can do whatever you want to get down. I don't care. Let's just come to sitting and then come back up. Chair if you need to, okay? If you're feeling like you want an extra challenge, you can go all the way down to your tummy and then come up, okay? That's the extra challenge. No matter what, so it's down to sitting and all the way back to standing or down to your stomach and all the way back up. We're gonna do it for a minute and a half. You're gonna count how many repetitions you do, okay? And we can share at the end or we can not. I don't care, this is just for your personal awareness, okay? If you're not going all the way down to the floor, you can try just a lunge back and then a big up to stand. That's a good choice too. Or sit to stand, okay? So if you don't want to go all the way down, that's your, that's your modification. Are we ready? Okay, everybody start with their big posture. You got to keep track of your counting, okay? Three, two, one. Here we go. All the way down and up. All the way up. And the big thing about this is you got to be safe, okay? So I don't care how fast you go. The number one thing is if you're going to get down to the floor, you got to be able to get up safely, right? Down and up. Good. Nice. I like the arms coming up over the head when you come back to standing because it helps you check your posture. Are you guys counting? <laughs> don't forget to count. If you don't count, then you have to start over. <laughs> All the way down and up. Keep your core tight. So no matter what you're doing, keep your core tight. And this is what I'm doing. Like I'm coming down to crouch. You do not have to do it this way. If you are more comfortable coming down to that kneeling position, and then coming to sitting, and then coming up, that's what you're doing. So you do what works for you. There's lots of different ways to get down and up. I want you to pick one that you feel comfortable with and that you feel safe with. We have 10 seconds. 10 seconds. You're counting your repetitions, remember? Yes. You're doing it. Good, three, two, one. All right, walk it out. Walk it out, I want you to remember that number that you had. Remember that number that you had, walk it out. Woo, we're gonna do some cooling down. Cooling down. Water, grab your water. Good. All right, let's do sideways steps. So just one step out to the side and then switch, okay? Amplitude. But I want you to just kind of nice and easy, still turning your palms up to the ceiling, okay? We're starting our cool down now, okay? So just one step out, back to center, and then switch. Palms up towards the sky, good. Nice and easy. Good, extend through those fingertips. Nice job. Two more. Good. Last one. Take those feet nice and wide. Reach up. Nice and easy. Easy weight shift side to side. Stretch out the side of your trunk. Good. Reach. 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 Good. Reach. Reach. Four. Three. Two. One, keep your feet nice and wide. I want you to just turn and let your arms kind of dangle down. Look behind. Rotate those shoulders. Rotate the shoulders and look behind you. The next time you go to the left, I want you to open up your arms to the back of your space. So turn as far as you can and then open up like you're giving the back wall a wave. Okay, hold it over there. Good, hold it over there. Hold it over there, big hands. Come back to center. Pendulum arm swings, nice and easy. Nice and easy, looking over your shoulder. 
Next time you go to the right, I want you to open up nice and big. Go to the right, open up, look all the way behind you. Big hands, spread those fingers nice and wide. Good. And relax. Good. Put your hands together. So hands clasped together, I want you to bring them to the outside of your right hip. So bring them right here. Got it? Up and across. And back. Up and across, turn, look behind you. Good. Up and across, turn. Good. One more. Up and across, turn. Good. Switch sides. Bring your hands to the left hip. Elbows stay straight. Big turn. Look behind you. Good. Feel that stretch out through your torso a little bit. And release. Good. Two more times. Stretch up and over. Look behind you. Good, one more time. Up and over. Good, pause. Nice deep breath in. I want you to raise your arms all the way up. Take up as much space as you can. I want you to try to get your body up straight. So head and neck over the rest of your spine. You're touching that imaginary wall behind you. Good, as you exhale, release your arms. Reach your fingertips for the floor. Good, deep breath in. Sweep the floor, come all the way up to the sky. Nice and straight, spread your fingers all the way out. Good, as you exhale, release your arms down. Sweep the floor if you can, come all the way up, take up a lot of space. Good, as you exhale, left arm down. Right arm up and over. Good, breathe, circle out that wrist a little bit. Good, deep breath in, come all the way back up. Exhale, right arm down, left arm up and over. Big stretch. Circle out that wrist a little bit. Good, deep breath in, come all the way up. As you exhale, release your arms down, grab your chair. Grab your chair back, or if you have a countertop, you can use that too. I want you to hold on to your chair back with your hands. Walk your feet back a few feet, and then I want you to press your hips back. Okay? You can bend your knees, but you should feel a stretch out through your back and maybe your legs, back of your legs, maybe your shoulders. And you can kind of shift your hips a little bit from side to side if that feels good. We're not forcing anything, okay? So if you're not that flexible, don't worry about it. Relax your neck. Think about almost like pressing your chest. If you could, pressing your chest towards your thighs. And a couple of nice deep breaths in and out. Good. And then I want you to take your time and slowly walk your feet in. Take your time. If you need to, if you're feeling lightheaded, kind of pedal out your feet a little bit. And then I want you to turn around so the chair back is behind you, okay? And you're gonna grab that chair back with your hands, okay? So grabbing my chair back. Good, and then I'm paying attention to my shoulders, right? Our shoulders are always like this. We're gonna pull them together, shoulder blades pull together, kind of press your chest up. So if you're like this, I want you to draw your shoulders so they're further away from each other in the front and closer together in the back. Yep, so pull your shoulder blades together. You're just holding this, you're just holding. Shoulder blades together, it's like a chest and shoulder stretch. Okay, you can push your chair down, you don't need to hold it up. You're just, hold, you're just holding the stretch, there you go. Good, perfect. All right, and slowly come out of it. Go ahead and take a seat in your chair.